Now then, let's climb us a vine, because we can. We can do it too. With can do. You guys remember that? Well, anyways, if you do, or rather if you don't, uh, there were some commercials on a while ago for pull-up diapers uh, under the brand name of can do. And uh, amongst other funny things I've noticed about that, uh, there's a kind of nuclear reactor called the can do reactor. I always thought that was funny. We can generate electricity with dangerous substances too with can do. And I'm also bad at singing, or are also bad at singing. Ah, god damn these flies. They have been a thorn in my side since day two. Ah! Oh well. And, uh, now then, one last thing to do while we're tiny. Go and pick up a ridiculously sized bean sprout with our Herculean minish strength. And take damage from flies, because we're dumbasses. Or rather, I am a dumbass, and you guys are, uh, I guess intelligent enough to mock me while I take damage like an idiot. Pick up the massive bean, bean sprout. Uh, some graphic glitchiness there, but that's okay. Fun story, you cannot walk her under these sticks with that bean sprout. So, they get in your way. Now, we just toss that in there. And we grow nice and big again. And now, let's grow us a bean sprout using our, you guessed it, Mount Kennel Spring Water. And, uh, now we're on Mount Crennel. I'm not sure if this is about time to end the video or not. I think I've only been recording for like five or maybe eight minutes, so I'm going to give it another couple of minutes before I end it. Woo! Dangerous times. Blow up that wall, because we can. I think. I knew. Ha <laughs> uh, Kill these bastards, because we can. Get us a kinstone piece, because we can. And all sorts of other things, because we can. And equipping a shield for no reason. In fact, the shield is totally useless in this area. I don't know why I equipped it. Blow some shit up. Break some root, uh, some pots. And... Cut that guy that is spiky. Okay. Um... You know what, I reckon I'm going to stop the video when I get the climbing ring. I think. So. Hop into the wind. If you have faith in your spin, jump into the wind. That's from Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga. Another great game that I may or may, or may not be LPing. Uh. I don't see why not, I suppose. But in due course, in due course. Anyways, up here we have what seems to be a sign. The Crenel Mines. I bet that's where we can get stuff. But, to no avail. We cannot go in there. Fuck you, sign. Oh yeah, these guys. They piss off every Zelda player. One thing that you'll be happy to realize. You can do that to them. You don't need the boomerang to take them out. You can take them out with a well-timed gust from your gust jar. Bombs. Kill that guy, because I hate him with a passion. And let's equip us a useful shield this time. Ah, the grip ring. Is there anything more somewhat useful and somewhat useless? Well, one cool thing about it, it lets us climb on these walls instead of just falling to our deaths like a dumbass. So for that I am thankful. And I know I said I was going to stop the video when I got the grip ring, but you know what? Let's get to... I don't know. Let's see if I can go for a 15 minute video. Just because I want to see if I can. Uh, my computer has a bad habit of crashing whenever I save my state. So, I don't know what I'm going to do. I might do a battery save or something like that. Um... Whatever. Anyways, true to Zelda fashion, 
we break the uh, the rules of the sign, though it actually says no bomb throwing, not no bomb placing. So we place our say bomb, and oh, would you look at this? A fountain. Well, whatever can I do? There doesn't seem to be anything appearing. Well, toss in a bomb. Wait a second. Maybe speed things up with the tilde key if you want. Because I can do that with my emulator. Um, Fairy appears, and she asks, did you throw in the golden bomb or the silver bomb? Now, I've always wondered what would happen if I said one of the golden or the silver ones. So I'm going to save my state. Say, golden bomb. And she says that I'm lying. And she blasts us with electricity. And now I feel like a dumbass. So, let's load our state. There we go. Okay, now we can carry 30 bombs. Um, not as useful as you'd think. At least by my opinion. Anyways, let's get to the top of the kernel wall, shall we? <sighs> Ow. Man, Link is a tough bastard. He just takes like three ton boulders to the face. He's like, eh, just brush it off. <laughs> Mosquito bites. Ha ha ha. Ah, this must be a tiring climb. Oh, not as bad as Yosemite, I bet. I bet Link is uh, happy he doesn't have to climb Yosemite. Now, if memory serves, there's a Trenel Hermit over there. But I'm not going to bother with him, because I don't think I have any kin stones that would match with his. Um, in fact, I know I don't, because I think the uh, kin stones you get in this game aren't randomized. And I just played this part of the game like two minutes ago, so... Anyways, turn small. It's pouring rain, but that's okay, because Link can take it. Or can he? As a matter of fact, he cannot. One, uh, one drop of rain on his head, and Link is kaput. Well, I guess several if you have a full life bar, but I'm not willing to risk it. Anyways, run through there like a boss. Get hit once by the rain, but that's okay. Then get big over here. So, first, push that into the hole. Now, this is the first, I guess, somewhat complex block pushing puzzle in this entire game. Uh, I always liked this, this part of the game. I don't know why. I guess it reminds me of my hiking days. But enough of that. <laughs> My hiking days. <laughs> They're still going on, baby. So, while I'm pushing this block around, I'm realizing that this probably isn't as interesting to watch for you guys. So, speed it up. Oops. There we go. And now climb down the ladder. Now, if memory serves, this is the one that is safe to cross. And I was correct. One of these blocks I can push. It's that one. Don't give me guff about it. Please. Please, please, pretty please. Push that block and that block and that block. And this block and this block. And finally, this block, this block, this block, and this block. This block. <laughs> Well, I think that's about a good sized video. It's probably been like 20 minutes. I completely lost track of the time. So, save my state. Take some damage like a dumbass. Don't seem to be able to escape it. So, uh, let's get out of here. Save my state. Pause the game. And hope I don't die next time. Uh, thank you for watching. And I'll see you.